Mabuhay! Speechless Heart here again and welcome back to my channel. So guys, this is the second part of my video. Related din siya dati doon sa video ko because yung first part nito is yung automatic bread maker machine tapos gumagawa tayo doon ng bread. But this time is pizza dough naman ang gagawin natin at the same time gagawa na rin tayo ng pizza. And makikita nyo dito na separated yung explanation ko sa video ko mismo. Kasi nga habang nagbe-bake ako is napakaingay so hindi nyo masyadong maintindihan. Kaya ito na. Okay, we have to put the flour, salt here. In a bread pan with the sugar and uh, some oil. I will put in the description below, guys, the exact measurement in the water and um, you have to put it in the automatic bread maker machine. Then we put the yeast in the yeast dispenser here in this uh, and um, we press the button menu uh, at number 16 I think it's number 16 here for the pizza dough yes and we have pressed okay just as easy as that so we have 45 minutes to wait for the dough to get done so we're going to prepare our toppings while waiting for the dough and after 45 minutes this one after 45 minutes we can take out the dough from the bread pan and form it into a ball and just Gagawin mo lang parang bola, din tatakpan mo siya ng plastic cover. Let it set and rise again for like 30 minutes. 30 minutes here. But in the instruction, it's just like 15 to 30 minutes. So it depends on you. So here, after 30 minutes, I already took out here and... We can divide it into two, but if you want a very thin pizza crust, you're gonna divide it into three. But I love like um, a thick pizza crust, so I just divided it into two here. You have to sprinkle a little bit of um, flour there to avoid uh, sticking. So it's just easy as that ito yung talaga yung gusto ko madalian lang kasi habang habang ano ito lang yung oras na nilalaan mo dito yung pag form lang eh wala na wala na ang iba ito lang talaga at saka yung pag ano ayan you have to form the ball uh, form the you have to form the pizza into a round form Pero pag, ano, madalas ko kasi, kasi itong ginagawa, guys. Every week, nag, gumagawa ako nito. Minsan, buo lang, hindi ko inahati yung dough. Pero ginagawa ko siyang malaking uh, rectangle na size. Pero ito kasi gusto ko yung round, so I make it two. Tapos, kasi walang hulmahan. Ano mo yung Tagalog ng hulmahan? Hulmahan ba? So, parang kinat ko lang din siya na parang plate. Ganito na siya. And, um, you have to press, just press the pizza dough with a fork. And, uh, after pressing it with a fork, ano lang, um, brush it. We have to brush it with, um, olive oil here. So, this is my favorite part putting the toppings on <laughs> yeah I love home baked 
pizza kasi mas mas ano mas uh, nagugustuhan ko kasi uh, depende kasi sa taste ko kung ano-ano na lang ang nilalagay ko pero this time ito yung mga basic talaga na flavor ng pizza ito na yung um, putting the sauce here pini-prepare ko na din yung sauce dito minsa may ready made naman na sauce Itong ginamit ko is ready-made na sauce na nasa uh, bottle na. Ayan. Bilisan. <laughs> Parang mah mahina ako dito maglagay ng sauce kasi ayokong naano doon sa gilid. Ayan sa I like putting a lot of sauce on the pizza. Ayana. Then we can put the toppings. I'm too excited to say it. This has always been my um, favorite part. <laughs> Yung toppings talaga. Kasi patapos na siya. Gusto ko marami, as in marami talagang toppings. Kaya yun ang nakakalamang pag sa bahay ka nagluluto. Yung homemade. Because you can put as much as you want. Yeah. I love bell peppers. And pineapples and mushrooms. And of course, yung nagpapasarap talaga is hulaan nyo kung ano. Yung nagdadala talaga sa pizza. Ayan na. Of course, ito na ang cheese. Naubusan ako dito ng ano. Na this time naubusan ako ng mozzarella cheese at saka yung ano parmesan. So, instead I put a lot of cheddar cheese here. But still, it's very cheesy. I like very cheesy pizza. Ayan. Tingnan nyo naman kung paano ko nilagyan. Ang dami-dami. So, before that, na, na, naka-preheat na ako ng oven. At this time, na-preheat na yung oven ko. So, it's ready to bake at a preheated oven. And usually, nabibake siya, uh, naluluto siya like 12 minutes. Well done talaga pag 12 minutes. Hindi ko na napakita yung paano ko pinasok doon sa oven. <laughs> Nahirapan akong mag-video. So, ito na lang ipapakita ko sa inyo. Ang final result. Tingnan nyo naman. Ang sarap-sarap. Ginawa ko to last Thursday lang. So, inedit ko to today. Pero, parang nalalasahan ko pa din yun. <laughs> so, sobrang sarap kasi. Dalawa tong ano guys. As in, ubos talaga namin. Siguro naubos ko nito apat na slice.
yeah. Ito lang talaga ang nakaganda sa bread maker machine, guys. Kasi it really saves a lot of time. At hindi ka na ano, hindi nakakapagod yung pagninid, yung minamasa mo yung dough. Doon talaga eh, ayoko doon. Kaya it's very helpful talaga na mayroon kaming um, bumili yung amo ko. Ayan, that's all for today's video. I hope you like it. Please don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye!